Hello everybody, this is Aqua Tammy, and we are back with the Drifter Challenge. This is house number two, part number 19. And if you're wondering why Bonnie is here, it's because she called at 3 a.m. and asked if she could come over. And who are we to deny our sister coming over right after we've given birth to her newest nephew? So, we said yes. And here she is. Woodworking with our husband Ray. He did stop woodworking long enough to change a dirty diaper, so, hey, you know, that's something. Also, um, we don't have as much money as we did have because I bought some paintings and did some decorating. Not massive amounts. I may have, I just got the, mainly the boys' room, I bought, you know, a bed, and then I put this to be between the two beds to put stuff on. Bought some paintings. I might have went overboard with the paintings, but oh well. And then I got in here, I bought two of these. I love these tables. Absolutely adore these tables. So two of these tables and some flowers, fresh flowers for the wife. I may need a f something right here. Maybe actually a mirror would be good right there. I'm not sure. But it's looking pretty good. And the house value is up to 36, 35, 36, something like that. So we're getting there. We are getting there. Bethetation Magra. It is currently, the teens currently have eight days before aging up. So we have at least seven more parts, probably. Probably eight, but at least seven more parts. So I think we're going to be fine. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ray would be better if he went to bed. Yep. Yes, you would, Ray. You would be much better if you went to bed. Everybody's asleep still. School starts in an hour. And I put all these cubes around so they do their homework. And it, since they became teens, they have not done their homework once. Because they come, all they do is woodwork. So they have not yet do the, to do their homework. So, anyway. <clears throat> may have to stay away from the woodworking thing in the next household. Once I get him... Once Caddick maxes his his uh, handiness skill, which is currently at six, once he maxes his handiness skill, we might have to uh, get rid of or put away or lock in a room, the woodworking bench, so that <clears throat> his heir does not spend all their days on the handiness, learning handiness, when they need good grades because they have to do a career in house four. Yes, I know these things because I've actually done through House 10 in the original rules before they were revamped. And I don't think they've changed that much. Um, so, I know the basics. Granted, I need to reread them before I do them to make sure I get everything. But, I know the basics. Someone's watching the TV. It's a miracle. Of course, she does it right before school starts. For two seconds. But, hey, someone used it. I feel I feel good. And this house is the first house I've done in a long time that does not have a computer. There is no computer in this house. I may need to buy one and put one in. But there is no computer in this house. Anywhere. Of course, if I did that, I'd probably need to unlock the bedroom doors. Yeah, probably would. Okay, Brooklyn, have you had all your sleep yet? Almost. Bye, Bonnie. Have a good day. Call us at some time other than 3 a.m. next time. Crazy, crazy Sims. Calling early in the morning, wanting to come over. Just insane. Speaking of woodworking, let's go ahead and clear out his woodworking. Um, I've done it not that long ago, so there's not that much in there. Just like to keep it cleaned out. And Ray is 69 days old. Oh. Hey dearest, thank you for coming and dealing with our garden. Well, we have some dragon fruits on the bro. You're awake! 
Brooklyn is awake! Yay! Why don't you use the bathroom? I don't know why it gives her the option to try for a pregnancy test. She hadn't done anything since she gave birth. That's weird. Well, whatever. Nothing I'm going to worry about. Let's see. You need to eat. You're going to eat cake? Seriously? Sure, go eat cake. I don't care what you do. Geek Con's in town. Well, we don't need to get, go to Geek Con. Oh. No, Bria. Of course, if someone invites us to Geek Con, we wouldn't hesitate to go. Oh, in my offline family that I've been playing, the father went to Geek Con. He had never programmed before, entered the hackathon, made 16%, and won the computer. Because apparently nobody else entered. <laughs> That's all I can figure. How else do you enter with win with 16%? But he did. He won with 16%. Cuddle. Rock. Oh. Don't. No, 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 no. Ray. Thank you, Ray. Now that you've changed the diaper, we will. At least Ray knows how to do that. He knows how to change the diaper. He may forget to feed the baby, but he knows how to change the diaper. Yeah, it doesn't seem like we're going to get invited to Geek Con. Right. But that's okay. We didn't really need to go. Unless we were going to try our hand at the hackathon. That's the only real reason to go to Geek Con is to try to win you some money. Well, that's not the only reason. But if you're a drifter, probably the only reason to go. You could do go. Actually, you could do like missions in the spaceship if you went, I guess. If you went, even in a timed event, you would probably be able to take the spaceship up. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. Never tried it. But anyway. Just wanted to share my 16% winning the hackathon story. So, never fear. Even if your sim has no skill and has never hacked before, you too can win the hackathon. And a, and a computer. To put in your house. When you got as many kids as that guy has, he needs it. All the help he can get. Why don't you go eat another piece of birthday cake? Oh, you're inviting us? Oh, she's inviting us. So, my PC died, and this programming thing I've been working on, I can't... I figure I can use the machines at GeekCon to finish up. But I don't want to go there alone. Will you come with me? Oh, we can't let her go alone. Ray could stay here with the baby, right? Right? Sure he could. Okay. <laughs> Not going to take anybody with us. Kids are at school. And Ray can stay home with the kiddo. And we will go and enter the hackathon with absolutely no skill and see if we can win. Probably not. What the odd of me being able to do that two times in a row? Probably not good. Because all you got to have is one person enter with you and you're not going to get... <laughs> you are not going to win when you have no skill. But if no one else will enter and everybody will go play those stupid gaming rigs, you too can win the hackathon. It's probably going to tell us we have to hack program at GeekCon. We can do this. Oh, aren't you happy? See, she's happy to get out. There, see, she looks so much like Malcolm Landgrab. I know. I just, every time I see her running around, I think Malcolm Landgrab. It, I mean, granted, part of it is the hair, but... Hey, girl! GeekCon... The GeekCon challenges have begun. Head to the computers to test your programming skills in the hackathon or use the motion gaming rig to test your gaming skills in UGT. Oh no, our sister's entered. Go away. Oh, everyone's entered. Here. Come here. Mm -hmm. More choices. More choices. Why don't I have the option? I don't want to practice programming. 
Oh, it hasn't really started. It said it started, but it hasn't started. Because otherwise I'd have a thing to do the hackathon. That's this is actually pretty good because then maybe they will by the time the hackathon starts, they all these people will have gone away. No, no, come here and sit. Participate in the hackathon. Shh, don't tell anybody it started. They all left. Shh. Oh no, don't don't come over here. Stay away. We need a computer for our house. We need a computer to go in our house. Y'all all stay away. We're guarding these tables with our lives. No one can sit here. No one. Nobody sees us over here. We're hiding in the corner. Keep going, sweetie. Oh, we got our little thing done, too. Yay! We are programming level two. Keep going, sweetie. Keep going. You've got to fin- No! Go away! Go- No! Go away! Don't- Don't hack here! Go away! No! Go- Ooh! Go away! Evil people. This one is actually hacking, I can tell. Maybe she won't finish. She left. She left really soon. I have completed with a 12%. Well, it ain't great, but it's 12%. Now let's go check out what's going on over here. You want to play the, do the ultimate gaming test too, just in case? I would think we have little or no chance of winning that one. Because there's far too many people that will be entered this one. And, I'm, and there's a part of me that wants to stay over here and, and watch this table and make sure nobody... Y'all all go away. Oh, they're just sitting there. She's playing a game. She doesn't like she's hacking. Maybe none of them will hack anything. Don't enter. Don't enter. Ah, the hackathon has come to an end. First place goes to Brooklyn Shay with a score of 12 out of 100. See, you too can win a computer. Yay! We want a computer to go in our computerless house. I'm so happy. Brooklyn has failed the ultimate gaming test. Minimum score has to be 70 and she only got a 30. That's okay. What are you doing? You're eating birthday cake out of your pocket? Are you serious? There's like good food here and you're eating birthday cake out of your pocket? Let's buy some swag. Let's buy us an Emily snow globe because we can. And we don't need anything else. Just a snow globe. Thank you. Oh, I'm in a rocket ship. We're in a rocket ship. Who's this dude? Hamza Gomari. He's in the club just for the halibut. I think all my clubs have died. I think everybody's died off and all my clubs have died with them. It's happy hour at the karaoke bar. The festival ends in an hour. Finish up your activities before it closes. Be sure to come back next time. I'm sitting next to Darth Vader. I don't trust him for a second. How much time do we got left? Hour and 39 minutes? You got anything you want to do? You want to browse the web? You could go up in space. You want to explore space? Do I want you to explore space? What if something terrible happens? But it is like your only opportunity to ever go into space. Why don't you go into space? No, we only got 30 minutes. No, we're not going to do it. We're not going to press our luck because we want a computer. Hello, people. I want a computer. Aren't you jealous of me? You should be jealous of me. I want a computer. Now the question is, and this is the hard question now, which child's room do we put it in? 
the boys' room, which there's two boys now, technically, or the girls' room. I know, it's a hard decision. I wish their things weren't so red. Is this thing gonna be over yet? Has it started closing up yet? Yeah, now it's starting to close up, I think, maybe. I don't know what she's doing. Hasn't made any rounds today. Hasn't done anything with her garden today. Day is almost over. She's done nothing. Except for win a computer. I am a bad, badass woman who won a computer. I don't even know how much this computer is worth, but I think it's worth like $3,500. Okay, our thing is over. We gotta go home. Brooklyn, the thing is over. We gotta go home. Our little thing is done. Oh, thank you, Isabel Bennett, for congratulating us on our new baby. She has gotten wide over the years, but that's okay. Them is mothering hips. Those are sturdy, sturdy hips to carry a baby on. You know, if there was actually toddlers in this one, but there's not, which I'm okay with, to be completely honest. Don't really miss it that much. I mean, some things I miss, but yeah. If I ever really get to missing toddlers, I'll go to The Sims 2, load up a house, put six screaming toddlers in it. I'll be over it in a few minutes. Do you know what I mean? Do you know? Do you know? I don't know. I really don't know what's wrong with me. If that's what you're asking, don't have a clue what's wrong with me. Okay, the maid was here, which means she wasn't really. Gardener, uh, the garden is probably in foul shape, but. Da -da -da -da. <sighs> we really need to put it in here. That would require a desk. And we probably have to get rid of the yoga thing that nobody uses. Because uh, I really don't want to put them in a room that's locked. Do you know what I mean? But I could put a desk right there and stick the computer on it. There's our gardener. Hmm. All right, come on, computer. Work with me. Let's go in here. Oh, we don't have much money. Sitting here talking about putting something in here, and we are flat broke. We can get one of these little white ones. One of these would definitely fit in more. How much is this one? Four thirty. Oh, she stole a, print, a thing. Sell it. <sighs> I'm just going to get rid of all these. I don't know if it hurts anything to keep them. or This is our $3,360 computer. Boom. Computer. Now we need a chair. I guess we'll go with... Well, we don't have to. We could go with something in a different shade. We could go with like this. Which would kind of match that. Or, or we could get this in that green. It would be the same and yet different. Or we could get it in the blue. Oh, we dipped below the thousand mark. It's a crying shame. But our house is currently worth. I know, I know, I know, I know. I can't help it. I have to look. I have to look. $41,812. Yay! Yes, I clap. I clap when I'm excited. I can't help it. We want a computer. <laughs> Why don't you come in here and use the bathroom? And... And then I guess we could go on rounds. Doesn't seem as pressing a need at the moment. But nonetheless, it wouldn't hurt if we did. Ooh, there's our snow globe. We gotta put it on our computer desk. Harvest. Harvest. I don't know. 
harvest, dig, harvest, there's really nothing there to harvest, but there is something there. Oh, so let me put this on two speed. Oh, there's onions or potatoes, whatever that is. That's good enough for that. And harvest that. Oh, reached level six. Courtney reached level six. As I think Caddick is already at level six. Who is calling? Whatever it is, the answer is no. Nope, sorry. Uh -huh. Oh my god, they broke something else. Why is my gardener just standing around? Did she just finish and hasn't left yet? Ah, there she goes. Bye, sweetie. Thank you so much for your help. Now. There's our snow globe. Our Emily snow globe. Thank you for the invite, Bonnie, but no thank you. We are not going to go to the chalet. We are going to stay here and and do our stuff and sell some things. And take care of our baby. dirt frog and we have a surfer leaf frog. I don't want to keep the dirt frog. We might put the surfer leaf frog. Nope. We'll put the next big expensive frog I found at we breed. We'll put it up here on the desk. Put the snow globe over here. And we'll put it over on that side. When you finish, I'm afraid you're going to need to come repair that. Oh, we're back up over a thousand. That's the important bit. Oh, look, she's watching TV. That makes me happy that somebody's watching the TV. Oh, I need to just sell that. But I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna put it right there. So if I think you have to, to make it work with them, I think you have to do it like... Maybe. I don't know. I forget which way it is to make them face each different direction. Now I wanted to put... Sell all the stuff. Oh, we got to have some money. We got some dragon fruits. Of course, that was probably in our house value. So our house probably isn't worth enough now. Uh, 23 dragon fruits is $1,000. Maybe it wasn't so bad. Put that in the fridge. 
I want to put that in the fridge. Because we don't have any greens in the fridge. And we're going to breed this one. And we're going to put this one right over here. Ah. Boom. <laughs> Just like that. Why don't you come take care of the baby? Why don't you give the baby a feed? And a cuddle? And a rock, because we haven't done it in a while. Make sure that the baby gets his food. He's still got another day to be a baby. We have to make sure he's good and fed. And... Let me sell... These... <laughs> and so these <laughs> and I feel like we've got a lot accomplished today alright so we're going to end this part here Cause I'm going to I think I'm going to send her to sleep it's a little early but that's okay I don't mind it's midnight so thanks everybody so very much for watching and we will see you back here real soon bye everybody